Thank you, Jeff. Big six, Nick. Zachary Lopez joined the Vista Pal Boxing Club when he was a kid. It's kind of funny how many of us have grown up and we're still in the sport. Lopez now owns the club and has helped teach the next generation. Victorious or defeat, it's, it's learning. But earlier this year, Fred Meyer, who has leased this building to the club since 1985, informed the club they were planning to sell this land. Fred Meyer's has been a huge support for us over the years. The club has worked to find a new place for their gym, but they've also had to close their gym because of COVID-19, and that makes the future uncertain. If COVID shuts us down, then you know, that could bankrupt me. And I don't know that we can do that. As much as I love the sport, I don't know how much I can risk my own home for that. The Vista Pal Boxing Club caters to youth whose parents don't have a lot of money. We're probably the lowest cost sport in Meridian or Boise area that I'm aware of. The club charges $10 a month, which includes all the equipment, the training and the coaching. Lopez doesn't want to see that change. My biggest fear is going to be the cost of at least just with the changing of real estate in the times and how much more it's going to be. If I have to pass that cost on to the kids, so many kids are not going to be able to do it and be involved. A lot of these kids, who are now adults, have reached out to show their support as the club moved all of their equipment into storage. And now the gym sits empty. Now you see it's just a shell of a, of a building. It's, it's sad. Yeah, you can get emotional looking at it. But hopefully it's an indication of bigger and better things moving on. The club will continue to fight. Steve Dent, Idaho News 6.